Okay, you bug fans out there, I've got uh, an insect that is probably familiar to you, but uh, maybe you are not familiar with the Japanese name or the appearance. This is a, uh, a bumblebee, of course, but here in Japan they're, not, they're called a kumonbachi, and uh, that comes from the word hachi, which means bee, but you change it a little bit if you add the kumo, kumon at the front, and I believe that the kumon part is bear, so this would essentially be a bear... Kuma. Kuma. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> someone, someone much better at Japanese than I is uh, keeping me honest. Kuma, so kuma is bear, but this would be kumonbachi, not kumonbachi, that would be spider, spider bee, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm all confused. As, as usual, and by the way, it's a children's day, happy children's day here in Japan, the flags are flying. But anyway, let's just stop for a second and get a close-up shot of it. Isn't that beautiful? You can see the uh, stinger and the characteristic uh, hairy uh, abdomen and thorax there. It's been dead for a little bit. I uh, was buzzed by a number of these yesterday in the mountains, and I'll be um, uh, showing a couple of videos of those. But it's usually hard to get a video of these because they're, they move so fast and uh, so uh, so agile for such a, a strange-looking, uh, un unlikely flyer. You know, so it would seem very, very nice. Japanese uh, kuma, uh, kumonbachi bear bee, or a.k.a. Bumblebee, as it's called in the West. Look at those eyes. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. I catch up with my family. <laughs>